is today February the 8th and I haven't written anything the last couple days because listen to me <clears throat> I've been knocked on my ass with a horrible head cold and just yeah thinking has not it is <laughs> no so what I did do is I read this book The Blood Gospel by James Rollins and yeah I'm gonna film a review so stay tuned for my thoughts on that so continents uh, work on my own country and at some point I'm probably gonna get coffee because I've been taking daytime um, daytime Benadryl, Benadryl, I don't know whatever that daytime B cold medication is and I don't know it messes me up more than the nighttime does so I've been surviving off of coffee and yeah. so I'm gonna go try to get to work and do the things that I have set up for myself to do today and hopefully uh, this cold will be mm, mostly gone by tomorrow that would be nice <laughs> I hope <laughs> alright let's get to work currently my lovely friendly wonderful dog is watching outside every two minutes so I am getting nothing done I drew a bunch of squiggly lines on a piece of paper <sighs> okay I'm going to go get coffee now because my brain is tired of thinking but I finished drawing all of my plate tectonics and directionality arrows and I plotted my country and I'll add a couple more, but I'm not too concerned about continuing on until I do an actual world building series. But I am going to take out a poster board and transfer my uh, continent onto that so that I can start mapping everything and uh, getting the world planned out and figure out my um, distance per like, centimeter. However, I want to work that out so that I can measure things properly and do my journeys have them be the right amount of time so that's what I'm gonna do and I will just show you this really quick so here is my world stuff it's kinda hard to see but there's an awful lot of arrows going on awful lot of directions so that's what I've been doing this morning okay I'm working on convincing myself to commit to the poster board idea and starting um, a legitimate map of my world but it's going to be a lot of work, and I also have to video it all, because I'm planning a world building series, and I want to use the footage, so... Oh, it's going to be a long afternoon. But that's okay, because there's not going to be nearly as many days in this vlog, seeing as, you know, it's already Wednesday this week, and I try to only do this on the weekdays. So you'll get three-ish. Yeah, probably only three days, so... Oops. Back to work. So I'm finally at that point where the cold meds are seriously messing with me. So I'm going to leave this for today and not struggle through anything else because Lord knows it'll be a mess that I need to fix tomorrow and I don't feel like fixing a mess. So I am going to go maybe take a nap <laughs> before I have to teach tonight. Have a good night and I will see you tomorrow. Today is February 9th and I have coffee and I am not taking cold medication today so we're hopeful we can make it. And my singular plan for the day is to um, draw a map. Pencil a map. And that's it. I might look at my other stuff, but no, I probably won't even do that. I have a lot going on today. I have to teach later, and I have orchestra practice tonight, so map is it. continent or my country whatever you want to call it I drew it in pencil very lightly so while I still have light I thought I would say good night
that rhymes. <laughs> I need to go to bed. I'm going to see what I can get done on this later. Um, I want to be back into writing by the start of next week, I think, is a good goal. So, we're getting there. We're getting there quickly. I will talk to you guys again tomorrow. So, there's a Chinook today. Which means I'm a little bit out with a headache, a migraine. <clears throat> but, it also means that I have a good laugh. Because every time there's a Chinook, I think about that genius, Leonardo DiCaprio. He's a bit of a joke for people where I live in Alberta. <laughs> From when he filmed his movie, The Revenant, and there was Chinooks. And he made a comment about how he witnessed climate change firsthand, but no, you actually witnessed a Chinook, which is very normal around here. So, that is what's on my mind. <laughs> and, I don't know, I'm going to have to find something to do that does not involve looking at a computer screen at all. So, I was going to take a break from my map, but I guess I'm back to that today. So, mole mapping. And I'm definitely getting coffee later, because caffeine is supposed to help migraines. Drinking lots of water. But, let's get to it. I can get through my day. Instead of pushing on, I'm going to take a break and maybe have a bath, relax, take some more Advil, and tomorrow I'm going to color in my mountains so that they start looking more mountain-y and not just like pencil scribbles on a page. So that is my goal. This has been Friday. It has been a good day. This is the 10th already, the 10th of February. Hmm. Well, I will see you tomorrow. Please enjoy my cat back here. I just bought him a new toy and he's very happy. Anyway, I, th <laughs> I thought I would sign off now because it's Saturday and I have friends from out of town coming in for the remainder of the weekend, so I probably won't get a chance to write, but I'm going to go get coffee, start the laundry, and then I am going to start to figure out um, shading and how I want to color my mountains, which is very daunting, because once you put that color on the page, you can't take it off. So it's a little stressful, and I'm going to go do that. So. I hope you enjoyed this little vlog of mine. <laughs> I will catch you again next week with another one. Um, comment down below with your map drawing techniques and how difficult was it for you to commit to whatever shape you wanted your world to be. I hope you have an awesome morning, afternoon, or evening, whichever it is, wherever you are. <laughs> See ya. Are you enjoying?